insert in the bulletin this weekend contains some great information from FORMED on their studies in May. This service is free to our parishioners. Simply go to their website and enter the parish code from the flyer. This month they are featuring the gift of femininity, a Marian study on the gift of womanhood. This is the annual Archdiocesan Mass Count Weekend. The information is used to guide the parishes in planning and ministry. Forms and pencils are at the end of the pews. At this time, we ask that each family or household complete the form. All family members present should be included on a single form. Forms will be collected by the ushers following the first collection. The May edition of the Catholic Review has been mailed to all registered households in the parish. Incorporated into this issue is a 12-page special section on the pastorate planning for the Archdiocese of Baltimore, which should be of great interest to all. If you are a visitor or are not registered at St. Isaac Jogues, please take a copy home with you. This weekend is the last weekend at which we will have our seminarian team. Deacon Kyle and seminarians Chris and Kevin will be speaking at all Masses this weekend. Please take a moment to thank them for their help this year and continue to pray for them as they journey towards ordination. On Sunday, May 7th, we will celebrate our Closing of Faith Formation and Volunteer Appreciation Mass at the 1115. All those who volunteer in our many parish ministries are invited to attend. Following the Mass, we will host our parish picnic on the front lawn. All of our parishioners are invited to attend this afternoon of fellowship, games, and fun. On Sunday, May 14th, we celebrate the May Crowning at the 9 a.m. Mass. All are invited to attend this beautiful Mass as we crown our Blessed Mother statue. And now, let us join our voices together in prayer, saying the words to our prayer for the season of Easter. The words may be found in the cards in the pew book racks. Lord, 